will be back for you guys for the final stream of the 2017 Cash Game Festival. Please come and join us. Praise. Pretty sick hand there. Enjoyed it. 55. Um, I don't know Paul. what Beth's saying, but I'm be I bet she's asking for a bomb pot. Ah. Ah, oh, you Paul. did. Ah. Where everybody, Paul. I believe, puts in one big blind right before the start of the hand. Uh, oh wow! Oh, and we didn't have it on the stream. That's heartbreaking. Oh wow! Oh, and she wakes up with the aces. All right, so here we go. No spoilers. Let's get into the action. Beth with the pocket aces under the gun plus two. She's actually had a brutally tough day. We thought she got put in some really tough spots. Race. I think I will ask you about that ace two hand afterwards <laughs> also. That was pretty sick from you. Yeah, yeah. A little bit of a big raise, but I'm so, fine, especially with the straddles. Now nah, with the straddles is pretty standard. Open to 55 with the aces. No spoilers, please. No no dancing around in the background, thank you. Erty has the sevens in the small blind. He calls 50. Lassa in the straddle, interesting spot. Wouldn't be surprised to sometimes see a squeeze here. I would often squeeze in this position. He does have the king queen blockers. He does. He, does, uh, he has squeeze. He's made it 165. Beth doing the happy dance in her mind. <laughs> Show tunes going off, loving life, thinking about what to do. All right, I will. Well, I'd expect to see a flat. Now, no, I think Hold. with Erty being in the small blind and them all being deep, Lass is an action player. I, I, I actually favour a click here. I would make this anywhere in the range of sort of 285 to 300. We have position. Lass is out of position. I think that if we flat, there's the danger that when Erty comes along, we can lose a huge pot. Yeah, I love this. I think this is absolutely perfect. Like. When Lassa, you know, does squeeze from the straddle, he's going to have some real hands that want to get it in, that want to get more money in. I think this is perfect. Wow, and Erty, as we know, oh no, he did fold. Yeah, my apologies. I thought Erty maybe would like the action. And Lassa does not like to fold. May think that he's getting too good of a price. 135, you know he's to call 545. Yeah, getting four to one. Wouldn't be surprised. I mean, he's not going to be loving life by any stretch of the imagination. Race. I don't know if he will fold though. Well, it's only 135. Just yeah. He's getting four to one. Looks like he's thinking and considering a raise. Call. Twice. Twice. Yeah, it's definitely not an easy failure at all. Yes, yeah. Cal Thor, I do agree that calling 4-bet should be good enough. Definitely not left <laughs> what, what he needs to be thinking of is what bluffs, what 4-bet bluffs does bet have in his Has he re-raised? Yeah. Well, he's, he's going to be in for trouble. <laughs> Obviously, Beth's just going to jam now. He's going to be pot committed. Yeah, he's all in here. Can Beth hold with the pocket aces? Big, big blow up here from Lassa. Getting in 1.2k free with the king queen off. Not a fan of this whatsoever. You have deuces. <laughs> now, can Beth find the hold to get out of the hole? It's been a difficult, <laughs> difficult TV table for her, but this would be getting her out of it for the night, I would imagine. Are they going to run it once? Are they going to run it once or twice? So Lassie just needs running. He needs running clubs or running Jack Ten. Yeah, even running queens. Beth now has a lock on the hand. Maybe double pull. I bet digging his own grave robot, absolutely. A nice hand for Beth there, as we've seen. We've there you go, she had get... the best of luck all night. Yep. Good to see her close it out. Always oh, loving life there at the end of the night when you pick up the ball and ace against King Queen and get the ace King X flop. Especially against the Andrew Peaks as well. They, they are running it twice, it would seem. And there you go, she wins both boards, living the dream. So he would. So nice end to the TV table there for Beth. It had, it had been brutal. We had been feeling for you in the booth. Ah, for the quads, right? Okay. 
So guys, we think that that may be the last hand. We think the stream might be finished. Card in six. A couple of minutes. Fit finish up. Alright guys, so we did hear that there was a bomb pot in progress after the stream. But um, we, I think that is the end of our stream for the first stream of our final day at the Cash Game Festival guys here in Tallinn. So the plan is now we're going to get some food. we got some 5-5 five, five PLO you. Omaha you. coming up for you guys in about 30 or 40 minutes time. Please come back and join us. I'll be here. Ryan's going to join me again in the booth. Cheers for being here for the first one. Cheers for the support guys as always.